Today on the table, I've got an Asus Tough FX505 DT. Now what I'm going to do here is a bit of a teardown and see what can be upgraded in there. So to begin with, I'll be using a small Phillips head screwdriver. It should be something most people will have laying around their house. All the screws themselves are hidden in very obvious locations. I thought there may have been a hidden screw or two throughout it, but there certainly wasn't. So yeah, props to Azus for that. Anyway, a bit of prying with also a plastic pry tool. As you can see, I'm still working my way around. I'm almost in there. A few more tabs need to be disconnected. There we go. Bingo. And we're in. So looking at the board, it's a fairly standard layout. We have an NVMe M.2 over there. We have one spare RAM slot, one used RAM slot, and one 2.5 inch drive. So looking here, we've also got the speaker. There's the other speaker, so they're both side firing, so for audio that's good. We've got a 2.5 inch drive. We have a removable DC jack, so if that gets damaged it can be replaced without having to do a huge amount of work. One fan, one copper pipe to the CPU, one free RAM slot, one occupied RAM slot. Where are we? We are 2666. Excellent. So a faster variant of RAM. The GPU does look a bit undercooled over there on the left hand side. With only two copper pipes, one removable CMOS battery. Yeah, so the copper piping here, there is a slight gap there. I'm not sure if that will make too much difference. And we have an Intel 660p SSD. And that's a 512 gig model one. As you see slightly further down, a 48 watt hour battery. So yeah, that is the Azus Tough. Bye.